Hello, I'm Lori from Keep Life Tasty, where it is our duty to please a foodie. So today I'm going to try something new. I happen to eat a lot of tofu and I thought it would be really fun to use our uh, shakshuka shaker to make um, a, a, like a mock shakshuka dish. Shakshuka is a, a Middle Eastern dish and it's typically made with lots of tomatoes and a beautiful sauce and uh, garbanzo beans. And then what you do is you heat this sauce up in a pan and then you crack eggs in it and the eggs just simmer and cook in the sauce and it's really delicious. But uh, today I'm going to try it with tofu. So the ingredients I'm going to be using in this dish are the shakshuka shaker, uh, uh, some spinach, I've kind of ripped it up a little bit into pieces, some firm tofu, about eight ounces of firm tofu, and I've chopped it up a little bit. I'm going to use our original garlic spread and all of our products are plant-based so that works out really well for me because I don't eat meat. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take probably two teaspoons of oil and put it in a pan here. Let that heat up a little bit and I'll tell you a little bit about uh, what let me tell you what the ingredients are because this blend together is so tasty and it's so good on everything. Um, it's got garlic, onion, smoked sea salt, paprika, organic yeast, extract, sumac, cumin, black pepper, vinegar powder, basil, parsley, chipotle pepper. It's just a delicious blend and um, my husband made some mushrooms the other day and he just sprinkled some of that on them when they were done and they were delicious. Okay, so this oil is hot. I'm going to take my tofu, put it in the pan, and I'm just going to, going to, just going to heat it up a little bit here. This could be a really nice snack because we feel it's snack time somewhere. Or you could, you know, elaborate on this and make it into a meal. So, let's see. I'm going to toss this around a little bit. Now, ideally, I would let this simmer for a while because I want it to get a little bit brown. I have a feeling it's going to take a little bit longer than I expected. After you see it starting to brown, take a, just a, I would take half a tablespoon of our garlic, the original spread garlic. And then just toss that around a little bit. Now I think I said this before, uh, this dish is typically made with garbanzo beans, which I love, but I don't happen to have any right now, so I'm not going to put any in. I want this to be something that you might have in the fridge and you could grab and just make kind of on a whim. All right, I'm going to put my spinach in. And you can put as much or as little as you want. Okay, scramble that up a little. And then what I'm going to do, I am going to cover it for a little bit and let that simmer just a little bit. Okay. Mm, smells amazing, I tell you. Okay, I think it's probably simmered long enough. I'm going to take off the top here. Oh, it smells so good. And what I'm going to do is, actually, I'm not going to do this right away. What I'm going to do is take this, slide it onto my pan, turn off the heat first, and then I'm going to take my shakshuka shaker. and sprinkle it and of course just mix it up a little bit. Oh, I wish you could try this. It smells amazing. It's so nice to um, just 
trade off once in a while and use tofu as a meal or a snack. And this is just a really nice way to dress it up and make it delicious. So my dog is waiting for his taste right underneath me. He's been waiting the whole time, but I get to taste first. Mm. So good. Oh, that's delicious. So I hope you might want to try this and I want to invite you to come to our website and uh, always remember to keep life tasty.